And he just snap it. Snap it at one. Four man rush. Riley's pass deflected and intercepted. And run back out of the end zone by Josh Pinker. Third down and eight. Midway through the third quarter, Sanchez in a crowd flag thrown at the feet of one of the offensive linemen. If it's for holding, it'll be turned down because it'll be fourth down. Yeah, they're going to get fall at the guy we circled. Penalty decline, fourth down. We we'll watch it, and Follett gets great leverage. He has a good job of getting off the football, and he'll dip his shoulder. There's big ground. Here comes Follett. Now watch who wins this battle. Follett, like a track star, gets off. Watch him lower that shoulder. As you see Brown protecting his quarterback. There's nothing you can do but to tackle him. Hopefully you won't get called. But he was caught in the act. There's Voidnick with the punt. The shorty. Handled by Sid Kwan Thompson. And a terrific run back to the 35-yard line of SC. Chris Gallipo made the tackle. Thompson's a dangerous punt returner, brought one back for a touchdown earlier this year against Colorado State. First and 10, California. Look out, Riley is taken down by a blitzing Kevin Thomas. Second sack of the night for USC. It comes back at the 43-yard line, a loss of seven. A lot of sacks are put on the quarterback. And when you have Kevin Thomas on a corner blitz, that's on Kevin Riley to get rid of the football. You have plenty of time, you gotta make a decision. So, after the 22 yard punt return, excellent field position for Cal, but they just lost seven. And now Riley throws down the field into a crowd. It's broken up, intended for Cameron Mora, who got his hands on it. But Taylor Mays was there, Mayaba and Will Harris also there. It takes a lot of courage to run down the middle in a Tampa 2 defense. Riley throws the ball where he needs to, and Moore just has it hanging out there a little bit. But when you have big six foot three, 230 pounds, coach Troy Palomalo, because May's a big Palomalo fan. Riley throws, and it is incomplete. And it's Mays again to deliver a blow to Nyan Botang. I'm not sure these receivers are too anxious to catch a ball in a crowd right now with the way these Trojan defenders are lighting them up. Kevin Riley had him open. He just threw it to the wrong side. If he puts it on the outside, Taylor Mays isn't going to be able to come over and make the hit. You see Botang with a nice job of his hips adjusting to the football. Yeah, there was confusion. You can see Botang and Ross gesturing at each other. And they weren't even involved with the play. That's the shame of it. Yeah, and the, they just couldn't line up right. Such a basic thing. Drive coach crazy. I had to go back and look at it several times. There was no announcement of the number of who was ineligible downfield. Usually when you get that penalty, it's against one of the interior line. It was the formation. We think that made the play ineligible. And Sanchez is sacked. Well, USC is the best defense in the country, but this Cal defense is with them play for play. And were it not for a controversial touchdown that was allowed to stand scored by USC, this could easily be a 3-3 game right now. Alu Alu with the sack. See Alu Alu right here working inside, falling coming from the outside. Alu Alu getting skinny, splitting a double team, and it's a three-step drop. If you're Mark Sanchez, if it isn't there in a the three-step drop, throw it into the stands for a souvenir. Third and long. Third down, 17. Sanchez knew this defense would be a challenge. Here comes a blitz. He got away from it, steps into a throw, and it's caught well short of the first down marker by Damian Williams at the 37. And this SC offense just cannot stay on the field. That's a three and out, despite the 12 yard game. Eight and a half minutes to go, and the clock running here in the third quarter. Cal still with about a five minute edge in time of possession. And they've managed just the field goal. Riley has a good pocket, steps into it, and throws too high in the direction of the tight end Cameron Mora. And there's another flag down. Personal foul, roughing the passer, number 93 on the defense. 15 yards, automatic first down. 
Everson Griffin was a freshman All-American last year. He started the opener as a true freshman. Good pass pro by Cal Bears offensive line. Definitely roughing the passer right there. Griffin's got to be smart enough once that ball's released to pull up. We don't need that shot. Now it's clear, Chris, this USC team is loaded with talent, maybe more than any team in the country, but it doesn't matter how talented you are. If you have this many penalties week after week, sooner or later, it's going to hurt you. Yeah, and it's hurt him tonight. It's keeping Cal on the football field and keeping their offense off the football field. Best trying to get that speed into the open and a quality run of eight on first down. And the clock goes under three minutes left in the third quarter. Possibly the best wide receiver in football. It's the quick hitter to the fullback. Tafolo refuses to go down. Will Tafolo, the senior from San Carlos, California, rumbles for 21 to the SC 33 yard line of the first down. Yeah, just catching him off guard a little bit. The quick hitter. You see linebackers running out the best because he's such a threat. And Tafolo says, Thanks for the sugar, coach. I'll make something happen.